I have one last question for Bill. Do you think AI is going to take over podcasting and stand up eventually? No. Do you think we're, we, we got a job? Well, I mean, has, has auto tune taken over like actually hearing a really good singer? Wow. No. Never no, it of. hasn't. Yeah, it's yeah, also yeah. like people, like to this day, people would still, you know, you can go to like Taco Bell or you can go to a legit place. You can always do that. You can mm. always like, if you don't give a fuck, there's going to people be people that don't give a shit. Mm. So they'll do that. But the thing about AI is at this point, it can't innovate and it, it can't like create. All it can do is imitate. You know, and sort of do some mashups or whatever, but um, yeah, like when I see a Beatles song, right? Like if that's an AI song, I can tell it's AI. Mm -hmm. it, it it doesn't have the same vibe, I guess, right? But it's like it's not a good song. It's never a song like I'm gonna buy that fucking single or whatever. I can tell you this: I went to a concert recently, and the opener was a DJ. And I have never been so fucking bored or confused <laughs> in my life. Yeah. It's like, what am I doing? I'm watching a guy playing records. Yeah. <laughs> and then just every once in a while, he kind of <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. do this. And I'm supposed to be yeah. like, ah, yeah. he's enjoying his stereo. Yeah. All the like, listen, <laughs> I get why you have to be completely fucking whacked out on drugs. <laughs> Yeah. Like, I don't get it. You go up there and you got, like, I just, I don't, I, I'm, look, I'm, I'm really obviously ignorant on the topic. Mm. I, I understand the genius of, uh, you know, the little that I've seen, Jay Dillon, guys like that. But I have to tell you, live, mm. just sitting there watching that shit yeah. was like, I just felt like I was watching a reality show. Like there was, okay, now he's in his living room. Is he ever going to go to the kitchen and make a sandwich? Like <laughs> yeah, it just yeah. didn't seem like this is not performance. Or they throw t-shirts in the audience. It's like, go behind the thing and do something. Yeah. Steve Aoki will grab and throw throwing stuff. He's a cake. So, I, I, cake so the whole concert oh, cake, was cake, like cake, that. Cake, I'm cake. sorry. Yeah. Like it throws was, cake. <laughs> there wasn't a band. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The headliner came out. There wasn't a band. There was the sound of a band. So it's like. Bill, I play, I, don't know. I play the piano. You know that, right? I didn't know that. Yeah. I play the piano. Let's start. You play like that Wu-Tang shit? <laughs> no, no, no. I, no, but I can, I, have, I play keyboards. I know how to do it. Let's try to, let's create a band well, with other comics. You jam first and if the vibe is. No, there, no, no, no. no. We go. force it like the Clash. They put people together. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Oh, is that we're like that a boy band. Yeah, the Clash were a, like, they weren't a band. They, a record company put they them They were together. a boy band, essentially. Yeah, right? essentially a boy band. But they, it worked because. You know, I mean, they're actually they know how to play instruments and no, Bobby. That's see, that, see, that's me in college playing in a band. Nice hair. I, di I didn't know that. Yeah, I was in a I was in a bunch of bands growing up. That was a psychedelic band I was in. Look at that! Oh my god, that's insane, <laughs> dude. <laughs> I tried that before stand up, and then they kicked me out of the band, and I go. Yeah, but I you got further than I did. I never got out of my parents' basement playing drums. Oh, you never played it live, in a band. I not until I I. Maybe did like the goddamn comedy. Gym. I know I, I've sat in with I've sat in with a few bands before then. Yeah. Um, <laughs> what's weird now? Stop! Stop playing that, man. It's oh, you look cool, man. You're yeah, yeah, yeah. But why did they fire you? <laughs> well, go back to the video then. I'll show you. <laughs> this go is back. The, the Bobby Lee behind the music. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. If you well, anyway, don't don't if you you can go on YouTube. Did that band go on to become the Spin Doctors? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. They, they dreadfully they went away after a year. It was, we were called Lax and Superb. <laughs> I know, I know. Yeah. Land That's, of happiness. Yeah, we were a hippie band. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Anyway, um, if you watch the Lax and Superb, there's an old man there with wearing like glasses. That's in there. So they are because we, we're kids, and they're like, well, these two hippies we met in fucking Escondido, they want to be in the band, and they were in their thirties. That guy to the right. Yeah. Right. So I'm like, I don't want old men on the fucking. Band and then you know I stopped going to fucking rehearsals mm. and then did they you get me sick out. of looking at his bald spot? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I couldn't. Fuck. Dude, I was like what nineteen there. He should have for you written, written the set list on the back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like he's yeah. Anyway, um, you want to plug anything? I will be at the <laughs> Arizona Financial Theater. Nothing says arts like Arizona Financial. <laughs> yeah. Proudly evicting snowbirds. <laughs> April 28th.